Greetings, VC. Um, it's me, Craig, again. Um, and uh, I've been wanting to do this for a while. And um, it's mostly just to thank two um, really um, gracious um, channels, um, JC from the flip side and um, Aaron Mother Elmar. Um, these guys just really welcomed me to the VC. And um, I'm very appreciative with their uh, the candor, their uh, their knowledge, um, stuff that they passed on to me. I'm very grateful. So I want to do this video and show um, the VCLT that they've given me. Um, again, extremely, um, just really kind and generous. The first one I got from um, JC, just out of the blue, he was just like, hey, I'm sending you some VCLT. And I was just like, wow, um, thank you. Um, he actually sent me, it's a repress, but um, I thoroughly enjoy this album. Um, it's uh, Van Halen OU812. Um, and uh, there's the, the album. Um, I was very thankful for that. Um, the same one, he sent me Foreigner 4. Um, I already owned a copy, but this is a way better copy. So that was a blessing in disguise. Um, and here's the, the record. It's on, uh, what's it called? What's on Atlantic. Um, nice sticker there. Um, so JC sent me that the first time. And then... Um, thanks to JC, I got introduced to um, to Aaron, Mother Elmer's uh, um, channel. And he sent me some VCLT also that just made my jaw drop. I mean, it was so, so generous. Um, so bear with me. This is going to take a little while. Um, but he sent me loudness, um, lightning strikes. Um, I used to have this album years ago, and uh, my record collection got stolen when I was a teenager. So I was so happy to get this um, sent to me. Um, like I said, all my albums were stolen. Um, it was probably between 150, 200, the German movers. Um, stole it when I was leaving Germany when my parent, my dad and mom got new orders to the States. Um, and then I, never, I stopped collecting um, because how can you replace all that? I mean, all that OG, Iron Maiden, Kiss, um, Kiss from like the first one all the way through um, Asylum, Iron Maiden's first one all the way through, uh, was it, I think it was somewhere in time where I stopped. Um, just so many um motley crew rat i mean all that um i just it just kind of took the wind out of my sails so um again i i had this album and i was uh just so happy for him to to send that to me um that was awesome I sent that one um he sent me ufo um lights out i didn't know much about ufo but he sent me this, and I can't stop listening to this album. It's awesome. Um, sent me a repress, um, Judas Priest, um, Turbo Lover. Um, again, I had used to have the OG, a bunch of Judas Priest um, OG. But uh, when I saw this, I put it, I, mean, I went right to the record player and threw this on. Um, my son looked at me like, what is this? Because he, he likes rock now. He's nine years old, his name's Nolan. Um, he just looked at me and said, Dad, what is this? And I was like, this is Judas Priest. He's like, whoa, that is so cool. Um, he sent me uh, Blue Oyster Cult, Extraterrestrial, live. Um, haven't had a chance to listen to all this. It's a double album, but um, that was great. And then this, like I said, I used to have OG. Um, this is a 1974 pressing Casablanca. 
um, but he's, he got me harder than hell. Um, man, brought back memories. Gosh, Aaron, thank you. Um, repress of Iron Maiden, made in Japan. Um, it was uh, on Capitol. Um, I used to, I had an OG of all kinds of Iron Maiden, so of course the same night, popped this on. Um, my son knows Iron Maiden, um, thanks to me. <laughs> um, so he was real happy to hear that. Um, repress Metallica Kill 'em All. I mean, I used to have the OG Kill 'em All all the way through, Injustice for All. So I was so happy to get this one again. Um, yeah, thank you, Aaron. <laughs> he also sent me Rainbow, Long Live Rock and Roll. Um, had some Rainbow back in the day. I didn't have this one. Had Man on the Silver Mountain, and I can't remember the other one I had. Um, but I've uh, been playing this one a lot, Aaron. And uh, he sent me, um, I never heard this before, um, but now I'm glad I did. Um, it's Vandenberg. Um, and uh, it's on Atlantic. Um, but he sent me a Vandenberg, which, like I said, I never really listened to it, but I'm glad I have it now. Um, he sent me Lover Boy, Get Lucky. I believe I had this when I was growing up. And he also sent me the Pretenders, um, which I did not have any Pretenders. Um, so, he sent me quite a bit. Um, my uh, collection grew overnight um, by 11. Um, I was, again, Aaron, thank you. Thank you so much. Um, so then, fast keep going into the future. Um, I got some more VCLT from JC from the flip side. And he got me Quiet Riot. Me um, Metal Health. I had this definitely OG. I had their second one and Quiet Riot 3, if I remember right. Um, man, I was so happy to get this one, JC. It brought back so many memories. Um, just thank you. And he also sent me one of my favorite, um, favorite movies, soundtrack, St. Elmo's Fire. Um, I really like this movie and I listened, um, I think I used to have the soundtrack, but, um, either way, um, this is my favorite soundtrack as well as Last of the Mohicans. Um, I used to have that, um, it's hard to find, but, um, that was, um, one of my favorite, uh, um, two of my favorite um, soundtracks, but he sent me St. Elmo's Fire, and this is on Atlantic, and uh, I've been listening to that one too, and the last one he sent me last week, uh, like I said, I've been dealing with um, sickness from COVID, and this has brought a smile to my face because it brought back so many memories. Um, I mean, look at all the hype it's got. Over 60 minutes of music featuring Burning Like a Flame. It's actually got a sticker here on how much it was. It has the, um, uh, the cellophane still on it. It's a little ripped, so i got to be careful when you um, handle it. Um, this is on uh, Electra. I believe this is um, OG when I looked it up. Um, I could be wrong. I'm, I'm still kind of learning it, but I did the inside of the wax, and the number came back. Um, didn't say that it was a repress unless I did something wrong. Like I said, I'm just learning some more. Because um, back in the day, you didn't really have that. Um, it was OG because you bought it when it was, came into the store. Um, but yeah, thank you, JC. When I opened this and played this, it just brought back so many memories. Um, like I said, trying to make this one not so long, but I just wanted to catch up and um, show my appreciation to um, JC and, and Aaron. If you haven't checked out their channels, please check them out, subscribe. Um, you know, there's so many on there um, that I've, I've, I've also, um, because of JC and Aaron, um, Chris Profi, um, there's just um, 
so many, um, so many that I, I, I can't remember, um, all of them. Um, and, uh, I'm, I'm enjoying myself. So thank you for, in, in, um, accepting me as it seems in the VC. And I hope to do, continue to do videos. Um, when I get VCLT, if I do, um, I will, um, definitely be up to date with the videos. If I get more fines, I plan on doing that. I think I plan on doing also a video in the future about my Kansas albums. I want to get some more, um, history before I start really talking about them. I just really enjoy them. Um, they have an interesting history and um, their music is, is um, awesome as well. So again, thank you again, Aaron um, and JC. Um, from the bottom of my heart, I appreciate it. Um, God bless and hope you guys have a good night.